Am I a fan of Budios? Budios, man. <laughs> Bodeos. Three, good, thanks. Anyways, we're on the game one here. Two scoops Dynamo versus Land Hero, Charlie the King. Game one, and we're going to go on the classic Samas Wheel. So, seeing a good early start for Dynamo. Easy 47%. Missing the bouncing fish. And now Charlie is answering back with triple fair. Wow. Oh my god, these guys are god! Oh my wow. god! What was that? Triple fair into jab reset. Why did that though? No. Back Whoa. air. That was fair absolutely disgusting. That was disgusting. That was in fact disgusting. This man should not be allowed to live. I what I say, man. I told you he's a ruffian. Yes, yeah, he's a damn. I mean, I wanted to defend him, say that he's a good kid. No, he's got a heart. This man is not a good kid. Do you I, see what he did? I, I can't say anything after that. You that see what was, he did? That was horrible. He took his damn lunch money, man. Why would you do that to your friend? Took, took him around the back. He, that's his friend. That is his friend. He did that to his friend. Yeah, what the fuck, dude? Okay, but you're dead though. Look at that. Yeah, Only good 90%. stuff, Dynamo. And that, real talk, that is actually amazing for Dynamo. Despite losing that stock in that kind of manner, he's focused. Look, he doesn't yeah. care. Does so not let care. it bother him. Just rolling with the punches. Roll with the fairs. I told you, man. He's a good kid. I tell you. Well, good catch with the win box. Gonna hit right back out. Now we're gonna ledge back play. on stage. Yep. Wow. Well, almost said like, <laughs> that was cool. to know what you did, but uh, I'm still trying to win here. Oh, he tried to pull him down to get another tech chase. Sure, up fair. Up tilt, yeah. Gotta get a timing. Uh, Balls right into the up tilt. And the balloon even extending the hitbox of the up air. Do it. Okay, and bouncing fish. No. Double jump. Oh, man. Wow. Yeah, good nair. Looks like uh, that was actually true. Up tilt into uh -oh. nair. Uh oh. Uh oh. Throw. Oh, no. Okay. Wow, is that how it ends? Yes, it is. Wow. Yes, it is. Oh, wow. That was an interesting uh, sequence of events. Getting Int is that what throw? you call that? Yeah, because he got... Is Dynamo that what got, you call that? What would you an call interesting it? What would you series call of it? events? What does Bam call it? He got blasted on, man. <laughs> what the heck? Interesting series of events. Yeah. Are we at an old man's yacht club? What the heck? <laughs> what is wrong with you, G-Fly? That was ridiculous. That's what I saw. Sometimes when things are too ridiculous, I don't want to just say how ridiculous they are. Interesting series of events, as it were. Anyways, we're going to go into game two. That's pretty crazy stuff, man. Not going to lie. Um, but I did like that how Dynamo was able to maintain his composure. And as long as he doesn't deal with a similar situation again, <laughs> Good to see him in a very good place as we see him right now in this game, too. Charlie, maintain stage control. Maintenance, man. Maintenance, man. Now, one thing that I haven't seen Dynamo do that I've seen other Sheiks do in this matchup is down tilt at the ledge to challenge Illusion. Ooh, okay. But. Apparently he doesn't need to do that because he just back airs fire. Yeah. fire. And uh, that's really good because Charlie usually misses those kind of or he usually does not miss those texts. He's really yeah. phenomenal at that. Of course you have to be so as, as a spacey, but he tends to be really good at it. This is a good amount of damage. Oh, saw the down tilt. Maybe trying to go for a down tilt, F tilt lock. What's gonna happen? But still in a good place here. Trying to come back down. Bounce. Bounces right off. I'm gonna get him there. Good back air. Yeah, punishing the air dodge with the back air. Yep, and you can send him all the way on the other side of the stage with another opportunity to get some ledge play here. Good pressure. The jump. Not getting the shield though. Just grab Dynamo right oh. out of the shield. He's holding that R button a little too long. Yeah, and up smash. Yep. Turn around up smash. I like that. Good play. There was really nowhere for uh, for Dynamo to retreat after that vanish. Oh my God! You are a God! You are a God! You are a God! All the damage in the world. Dynamo able to get back to the ground. Sixty-three percent from that vortex. Oh, if Dynamo could have made it there in time, I would have just dared. <laughs> uh, of course, if you go for a dare in that kind of situation, 
It will trade with a Foxfire, so... Or Firefox. And you will not die there. <laughs> Foxfire. Isn't that terrible? <laughs> terrible browser. browser. Browser you use. That's not that bad. <laughs> the browser that you use to get the Chrome. That is not the browser you use to get the Chrome. That's what I'd use to get the Chrome. <laughs> Back in the day. All right, up throw to get Dynamo above him. What's Charlie gonna do? Off to maintain stage control, keeping Dynamo on the ledge. And oh, using oh, oh, you're dead. That was really, really good call. I really like that. He understood the spacing he was at, and he knew that Bouncing Fish could get him. But in that situation, if Bouncing Fish does happen, then he can actually get a punish there mm -hmm. with the fair. He can just auto fair and pull him down. That's actually a really, really, really nice play. Yeah, That's very a smart move to use the oh, yeah. uh, shine to stall in the air. Yeah. Stay right up above Dynamo. Yeah. Right where he's That's gonna be. really, really intelligent. I love that play there because, again, that is a very typical Bouncing Fish. And the thing about it is there's a couple other situations where that Bouncing Fish sh should have happened, but he didn't do it. But this time around, he's like, all right, I know you're not going to go for this bouncing fish here, so...